Well, a great convention uh -huh. it was. Indeed, they all look forward to next year's we'll edition. We'll be looking forward to next year's edition right. also. So let's bring it back here to Nigeria as we go celebrate the former vice chancellor of the University of Lagos, Professor Oye Ibida Bay. Well, he clocked 70 and all his loved ones were around him to celebrate with him. Take a look. <laughs> In the Nigerian academia, Professor Yewusi Bidakobe needs no introduction for his numerous achievements, especially during his time as the Vice Chancellor of the University of Lagos. So, when he turned 70, family members, his former colleagues and peers, as well as other distinguished guests, turned out in their numbers to celebrate him as he turns three scores and ten. <laughs> His family, led by his wife, Mrs. Ulushalai Bidakobe, had planned a day where everyone dear to him will gather to celebrate him and have loads of fun with him and use the occasion to promote a project close to his heart, the Oye Bidakobe Foundation for Educational Transformation. For many years, the project has been done on a small scale. Now, the celebrant who is passionate about restoring education to its pride of place in our society and providing succor to indigents who are brilliant students across all educational levels in Nigeria has now decided to take it a step further. So we decided that we set up a foundation that we basically restore education to its price of place in society. So this foundation will provide succor to indigents, but potentially brilliant students across all educational levels in Nigeria. The chairman of the occasion, who is also the chairman of Zenith Bank PLC, Mr. Jim Ovia, attests to the passion in Professor Ibidak Obe to support education in Nigeria. As far as I'm concerned, and as far as many people are concerned, he's been transforming education by these great appointments. That's what he's been doing. So if Professor Ibidak Obe decided to set up a formalized foundation and has asked some of us, all of us in this hall, to give him a little push. I think he deserves to be given a little push. It wasn't an occasion for speeches alone. There was plenty to eat and drink, and good music filled the air. And it came to one of the most important moments, the cutting of the birthday cake. Now I want to dedicate my next 70 years to uplifting the society in concrete terms. Not generally has been Vice Chancellor or President of one society or the other. 
now to really ensure that I can see benefits in quantum of what we've been doing with underprivileged. Individuals and many groups came out to celebrate Professor Yewusi Bidako Bay at 70. <laughs> I came to university long after he had left the university that he was a legend of his time. Professor Ibida Kobe was the best graduating student university-wide of the University of Lagos in his set. Oye, Ibida Kobe and I are contemporary. But Ore was born immediately after the Second World War, which I knew a bit about long before he was born. What my dad does that I like is he always gives you the opportunity to give your best defense and try and talk yourself out of trouble. With every occasion packed with grateful hearts and good music, there's always dancing as the celebrant and his wife, as well as other guests, open the dance floor. like the luckiest person on earth to have him as my dad I wouldn't change it for the world I I love him he's awesome <laughs> Professor Uyewusi Bidako Bey serves as the president of the Nigerian Academy of Science he joined the University of Lagos as a graduate assistant and served as its vice chancellor until 2007. He is a fellow of many professional bodies in Nigeria and overseas. Professor Ibidako Bey holds a first class BSc and master's degree in mathematics, a distinguished professor of systems engineering, a former VC of the Federal University in Dufu Alikwe Iko Eboy State, and member of the James Hope College Agbo Board of Trustees. We wish him a happy birthday.